For the next two months, we're gonna smell. This is my friend Justin, and this is me. And tomorrow, we're cycling 3,000 miles across the USA. Not all tomorrow. Not all tomorrow. No. That'd be too much. We'll spread it, we'll do it over a few days. Yeah, 3,572 to be precise. I only train for 3,000. Do you want to tell the viewers what happened to your bike last week? You mean the part where all of it broke and none of the gears were working? It had a very big hole in it. And the gears still aren't properly working. <laughs> what have you got me? I love it, thank you. All good. Be it 2092 Miami, ladies and gentlemen, if your name is called, please do come forward now with all your belongings to get C64. Can you get me an upgrade? I'm gonna do my best. Somehow, things have worked out. Somehow? I'm, well, you mean because of me? Don't we like to call it wheelchair, wheelchair stuff? stuff. <laughs> business class. First time I've ever flown business class. Cheers, yes. brother. It's very romantic here. It's a nice setup. We turn these into beds. Hurry up. So here's the plan. We've flown into Miami and we're cycling to LA. We're going through New Orleans, Dallas, all through the Deep South, Phoenix, Las Vegas, Death Valley, then LA. It's over 3,000 miles, but 3,000 miles sounds catchy. And it's all in aid of an extremely good cause. Get kids going, exclamation mark. <laughs> what? You really insisted on the exclamation mark? That's what the name of the charity is. <laughs> Get Kids Going is a charity that helps disabled children and young adults by providing specialist equipment, sport grants, and year-round support so that everyone can have equal access to sport. Did you rehearse that? No. Wow. They've been helping me for a number of years because the cost of disability equipment like handbikes, racing chairs, wheelchairs is incredibly prohibitive for people trying to get access into being physically active. With Get Kids Going, the support that they've given me has been immeasurable into how I've been able to compete and just be happy in my life. This is why we're trying to do it for them. This is quite a unique challenge. We're riding unsupported, which means handbike with wheelchair strapped to the back and then a million bags on my bike. Justin, have you, um, how are you fixing your wheelchair on the back? Basically, just like this. Have you ridden with it yet? Once, in Regent's Park, for about 10k. It didn't fall off, so that's the important thing. This doesn't fill me with confidence, Justin. It is what it is. More on these bikes in the next few days, but in the meantime, we have to go and find some people in Miami to give a giant blue box to. TSA thought there was a vampire in it yesterday. All right, Wicky, we've got a sick one. We've got a massive f off Chevrolet. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. Thank you so much. The lengths we go to to protect my bike. Yeah. It's not like the cardboard box that you were able to take. Thank you very much. Hey, nice to meet you, hey good to meet you, Andy. Nice to meet you. Nice man. to meet you, buddy. Thank you so <laughs> much. You. Is it always a drug deal like this when you have to travel? With you? This one's delicious because it doesn't have too much. Uh, uh, it's just a wisp of smoke, right? And then, then you're hit with like caramel, sea salt, yeah. right? Cherry sautéed in balsamic vinegar, right? That, that's okay. what I get from this. A little, a little taste. Yeah. 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 This is where the whole trip just goes, starts going wrong. Potentially. I like to try it without first, right? Let's do it. And then, uh, cheers, buddy. Thanks for looking after the box. Welcome. <laughs> Before we leave, quick shout out to your YouTube. Cuisine Quest on YouTube, right? For short and sweet cooking and travel videos. Please hit me up. You I'll won't regret it. That's a, <laughs> a plug. One take. Plug. Done. One take. <laughs> Cut that out. Come back safe. So that was Andy. Super nice guy. Looking after our box. Your box. I don't. I don't want that box. I know you don't want that. Box. No, I hate that box. We are now on the way to get a SIM card for Justin. Pizza places, ice cream places, barbecue places. I think this is the perfect street for us to be on, and we can get a SIM card. Hello T-Mobile, please can I have a three-month SIM card? Yes you can, and you get a free phone. Pretty sick phone. 
What? For free. Why is it free? Because America is amazing. Don't Thank you better than your current phone. It really is. Thank you very much, Dom from T-Mobile Surfside. Justin, I feel like everything is off to a worryingly good start. Everybody here is extremely friendly, extremely nice, extremely accommodating, and none of our stuff is broken. And it's the first day. And the pizza was really good. Miami is so chill. Police just driving past, smoking cigars out the window. Don't put that in. In case I want to look at anyone's belly button before they come in. The next portion of this video is dedicated to Kamu, the fantastic app that we used to plan this trip, which we would have been using anyway, but they are officially sponsoring and making this trip possible by giving us some money to spend on motels and pizza a lot of pizza if you've never used Kamut before it's absolutely brilliant for planning trips like this you can go day by day with a start location a finish location and it will plot your route for you based on maps and data that loads of users who are also riding bikes have contributed to on top of this if you're doing a multi-day ride you can stitch them all together into something called a collection which is what we've done the best thing i liked about this is to be honest francis planning anything with you is a little bit of a nightmare but this made it pretty easy we could choose any of the road surfaces. I could avoid all of the gravel, which my bike can't go over. It's on the app, it's on the website. It's incredibly intuitive and has a really simple user interface. It actually was quite fun to plan, I'm not gonna lie. Despite Justin claiming that he did all the planning himself, I've actually been going through these routes with a fine toothed comb. To check the temperature and the temperature alone, whereas I actually looked at the road surfaces. Uh, no, I've been looking at the roads and the main roads and street viewing stuff. This is literally one of my favorite features. So when you're on the desktop version of the app, if we choose day two, you can see there's a map further down. And if you expand it, go full screen and zoom in on the route, you can then click open street view. And you can literally look at the route to see if it's a road that's safe to ride, that you want to ride, and you can actually see what it looks like. And you have the elevation profiles. And Florida is like a pancake. It's beautiful. And look at that. Not a single bit of gravel anywhere. Dreamy. Excuse me, do you want to stop making ticking noises behind my video? Sorry. As well as being a fantastic way to plan routes, Kamut is also basically a social media network. So you follow your friends, I follow Justin, he's been updating the route and I can see it happen in real time. Further to that, it means we can be posting our rides every single day underneath these YouTube videos, because I'm gonna try and upload every single day with a Kamut link and you can see exactly where we went. You can copy the ride if you want to, make your own version of it and see exactly where we've been. We're gonna drop some highlights along the way so you can see if there's anything interesting. So keep an eye on that description down below and you'll be able to follow exactly what we're doing through the next 55 days 55 days plus rest days we're gonna be here for a long 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 time justin are we still gonna be friends at the end i reckon we've got at least six weeks before we start to hate each other right sunset here in miami we need to get some sleep link down below to the just giving page for get kids going exclamation mark justin final word from you follow our journey that's three words oh shit. Muevete. Sabro.